Keith Robinson is an American environmentalist who is the co-owner of Naihau, the second smallest of the eight principal Hawaiian islands. Life Robinson was born c. 1941 to Lester Beauclair Robinson 1901 and Helen Matthew Robinson 1910 He attended the University of California Davis, graduating with a degree in agronomy and ranch management. After college, he served in the U.S. Army before returning to Hawaii, where he initially worked at the Kulai Ranch on Kaui seven years and then operated a commercial fishing vessel on Kaui for another seven years. Robinson and his brother Bruce own the approximately 70 square mile, 180 square kilometers island of Naihau in the Hawaiian island chain, which has been in the private possession of their family since their great-great-grandmother Elizabeth McHutchinson Sinclair, 1800 to 92, purchased it from King Kamehameha V for $10,000 in gold. He is also the manager of a private botanical garden on the Hawaiian island of Kaui. Robinson makes his home on Kaui, but visits Naihau at least once per week on average. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Conservation work on Naihau. Robinson has been credited for keeping numerous Hawaiian plants from becoming extinct, including Cyanea pinnatifida, which is considered extinct in the wild. I've spent 18 years and more than $250,000 doing this work, and I estimate it would cost the government or environmental groups $10 minus $20 million to create a comparable reserve. I've done all phases of it myself, scouting, seed collecting, seed germination, planting, transplanting, watering, growing, fencing, fertilizing, and insecticide spraying. In most environmental groups or botanical gardens, the work is highly compartmentalized. You get your plant scouts, your seed collectors, your nurserymen, and people on the grounds. They all have different duties, and their duties never change, so none of them has a broad overview of what's going on. They don't know what specific problems there are at various stages where you're trying to produce the plants. Topic: Contemporary activities. Robinson has repeatedly expressed his desire to keep Naihau privately owned so as to preserve the environment and traditions of its 150 to 200 native Hawaiian inhabitants, and has occasionally taken large financial losses to do so. As under their predecessors, the Robinsons have kept Naihau largely closed to outside visitors, though a few hunters and other tourists are admitted each year—but with limited or no contact with the islanders. The Robinsons continue to ban radios, televisions and mobile phones on the island, in an effort to preserve as much of the indigenous island culture as possible. In 1997, Robinson estimated that between $8 minus $9 million was spent to keep people employed, not counting the free housing and free meat provided to the 150 to 200 Naihau Islanders. 
After 135 years of operation, the ranch on the island shut down in 1999, rendering all its inhabitants unemployed. Robinson expressed concerns about his family's ability to continue to maintain their ownership of Naihau, due to pressure from the federal and state governments and environmental groups. Taxes on the island have taken much of the profits from the Robinsons' interests in agricultural companies. Keith Robinson has compared his plight on Nai How to Ruby Ridge and the Waco siege, threatening to defend his island with force if necessary. In 2005, a documentary on him was released titled Robinson Crusader equals equals family tree